we get to do things nobody's ever done before. Everybody wants to use the new technology. The amount of data we're dealing with, it's about 40 times more than a regular 2D 24 frame film. You're just trying to rattle me. I'm trying to save you! But there is some matter of risk with being bleeding edge. Using inadequate equipment for something like this, it means that they might miss a critical moment or a key scene. You can't ask somebody to recreate the perfect scene again. If I can't deliver shots to our partners at Weta in New Zealand on time, that means they can't make him look perfect in time for us to release the movie. The big sort of specs on the movie were that we shot at 120 frames per second in stereo 3D. So we shoot a mix of mostly 3.2K, but also 4K. So files are getting bigger, and how fast I have to ingest and move that data is increasingly getting larger as well. And when I run around initially to the usual suspects in terms of uh, media storage, they weren't really scaled to be able to handle that volume of material at the speeds that we needed to have it handled at. It was a large challenge, but we were able to abstract it out and break it down into a high performance computing challenge. Ang's vision for Gemini Man is really about immersing people in a story. And the thing that he is most compelled by when he's making the films are just a close-up on a human face. You know, that intimacy and that connection is really what he's looking for. The excitement for us, first and foremost, is being able to enable our customers to execute on a vision. The Gemini Man team found us, which was fortuitous. A lot of what they were trying to accomplish is directly related to the skill sets that we bring to the market. I came across Penguin and it seemed like a really good fit because they have experience implementing these kinds of systems. They were able to really tailor it for us. While it was being applied to media entertainment, it was the same type of things we do when we'd sit down and talk to somebody in computational fluid dynamics or biology, because it was really about how to capture and access data real fast and how to serve it out to um, the different technology teams that needed to use it. We tried to connect the dots back to on the hardware side to know what aspect of the server design would best accelerate and meet the performance metrics that a director like Ang Lee is looking for. We're generating a, a lot of data initially when we start shooting. We're transferring terabytes a day across the planet to all these other places. Is how quickly can we get this in front of Aang? How quickly can we iterate on the things that we're doing in post-production? The solution that we delivered to Skydance for Gemini Man was a Frostbite solution specifically custom designed for them. It's not just that we had to get this storage and put it in a, in a facility and leave it there. We had to hump it all around the world. Hatahena, we in Hatahena. To be honest, that was a challenge for us. Suffice to say, we did find a very creative solution, and so it was a bit of a collaborative effort in terms of how we ultimately created a portable platform. At every location, we had a team of solution architects and professional engineers. Penguin helped empower us uh, because we just didn't have to worry about the infrastructure. It was really all about just how do we make this movie. It's one thing to deliver and design the best technology. It's another thing to make it usable. It has to be easy to use, easy to manage, easy to support. Having the, the performance really taken out of the equation where I don't have to worry about it means that I get to spend more time as a filmmaker instead of as a technician. In between breaks, uh, Ang Lee came over to our team and thanked us for enabling his vision. And I don't think as a supplier of the technology that we provide, there's a greater acknowledgement of the value that we bring to the table.